while Fisherman's Wharf Marina is looking to become a destination of sorts for visitors to the Venice area, but decided it needed to make some adjustments for that to happen. As it is, John Woodruff has more now on the many improvements and additions marina managers hope will attract a lot of attention. John? Mike, Fisherman's Wharf and the Marker 4 restaurant have been in Venice for over 30 years, but they came under new ownership about a year and a half ago. This week, they're celebrating the completion of some major renovation projects. Pretty much everything except for the great view, I would say, has changed. The Marker 4 restaurant at Fisherman's Wharf has a new staff, a fresh coat of paint, and a new tiki area, which managers hope will draw everyone from live music fans to the football Sunday crowd. Even in the heat of summer, it's 10, 15 degrees cooler than anywhere else. Uh, the breeze kicks through there, we got fans in there, we got uh, five TVs in there now. General Manager Hal Christensen took over in May, and the restaurant reopened in June. He says the new menu will suit the tastes of tourists and longtime locals alike. People that want to get, you know, a nice grouper entree that, you know, is a little more specialized flavors or something new. Fisherman's Wharf Marina has kind of been a staple in Venice for a long time. We've just basically um, taken it up a notch. Marina manager Cassie Meyer says the Marker 4 isn't the only thing to change since new management took over at the wharf a year and a half ago. There's a new bait and snack shop. All new fuel and gas pumps on a refurbished dock, and some changes that are less than obvious. This blue flag marks Fisherman's Wharf as a clean marina, a designation given out by the Florida Environmental Protection Agency, meaning they have safe practices for disposing of waste, fueling and cleaning boats, and things like a manatee protection plan in place. I really feel like it's going to be the marina in Venice that people are going to want to have their boat, um, be a part of it, and. Um, we have a, um, a sunny outlook down here. Now to celebrate all these renovations, Marker 4 will be hosting a ribbon cutting and party tomorrow from 4.30 to 6.30 in the afternoon. They'll have free drinks and hors d'oeuvres and they expect a big turnout. All right, now John, uh, we noted in your story that there's a lot of changes there, but what about people who have been going there for years and kind of like it the way it was? Well. People have told me on Twitter that they were a big fan of Grouper, and obviously Hal said in the story that they still have Grouper there, so big fans will just have to go back and try it and see how it stacks up. Well, it looks pretty good. <laughs> All right, so. John, thanks.